hey youtube how are you guys doing um i haven't done i think i did a video like two days ago but i haven't been doing consistently in a little bit but i'm trying to get back on it but um what i'm going to be talking about is basically um quakes what's really going on guys the quakes are getting crazy and um i hope you guys are really paying attention to it um the seismic activity is getting off the charts what i've noticed is that the frequency of our planet is actually it's re the vibration is actually really really high at this point i've never seen this high and um so this is basically what i see coming okay they're going to be a very very big quake on the west coast it's going to get around 8.2 it's a fault line that go from mexico all the way to uh, california all the way up to uh, oregon that stretch all the way um, alongside Canada on the shoreline all the way over to Alaska. That's the, um, that basically, that fault line guys is extremely active. I really do believe there's an 8.2 coming. The 8.2 is not really going to be, the, the, the thing about it, I don't see it happening where online, I actually see it happening in the water right where Mexico meet the US, but it's gonna be in the water because the fault line run along that shoreline, but it's at that, where that point is, it's out in the water. So, uh, Indonesia is gonna get hit in a week from now. It's gonna be like around 6.4. Um, they're gonna get a big quake. Japan is gonna get a big quake. So, basically guys, we know what's going on. Everyone that's paying attention, we, we all know because you know, we're, not really listening to the mainstream media we are actually doing our research guys the binary system is getting extremely close the frequency and the vibration of our planet is off the chart it's behaving in a way i've never seen it before um it's quite interesting man uh we're really really living a very very interesting times and what i've noticed and i've been saying for quite a long time is that as this planet get closer, this binary system, people are gonna behave different. And I'm sure you guys seen it yourself that people are not, sorry, acting the same anymore. They're, people are not normal. They're acting weird. And I do believe this binary system that's inbound to, towards us has a lot to do with it. Uh, we all connected to this planet, whether you wanna believe it or not. If our frequency and our vibration of this planet change, our mood, our behavior, our attitude will change. This is what I see what's going on. The people that are actually grounded and are peaceful and are happy are actually gonna experience more of that. The ones who are negative, on a negative vibration, low vibration, they're gonna basically go bonkers. And you guys seen it for yourself. They're gonna go off the wall, off the rip. Um, being in a large, crowd now it's not safe and this is not being i'm not being a fear monger fear fear monger guys I mean, it's just pragmatic realist i know what's happening to a planet and i know the planet affect us as human the planet is not right so humans are not right so if i know deep down that humans are not right they're not vibrating right why would i want to be a, around a large group of them it doesn't make any sense right it increase my odds of something happening correct if i know they're going to go bonkers why would i want to be around a lot of them because as i said we are tied to this planet. Our planet is not right. Our vibration is off. It's extremely high, way higher than it's supposed to be. So what do you think gonna happen to human being? Think about it. If Earth's getting messed up by the binary system that's incoming, what's gonna happen to humans? Of course they're gonna get messed up. It is what it is. This is what's coming. As you get close to humans, gonna get even crazier. But, you know, what I'm trying to say, folks, is that get yourself ready, prepare yourself, learn as much trade as you possibly can, skill set. Skill set is way more important than having that piece of paper that you guys call degree. I'm going to be completely honest with you. You guys have some skill sets, some survival skill set, I promise you, you'll be all right. Um, so if you think that piece of paper that college gave you is going to save you, you have a sad, you have, you, you need to rethink your priority because that, be, that piece of paper don't mean crap. I'm just gonna be honest. I have more, I would rather be around somebody who's more skills, skilled with their hand and know how to survive and know how to build things 
rather than be around somebody that have more degree than a thermometer. Because I know for a fact he ain't gonna save himself and he ain't gonna save me. The person who have the skill set, they are the liability. The person who have the paper, they no, the person who have the skill set is the asset. Sorry. The person who only have the have the, 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 the their knowledge on a piece of paper, they are the liability. Those are the people I do not want to be around because they don't know how to do nothing. Period. Because they are what is it's called predictive, um, predictive programming. Okay, they're being programmed to take orders all their lives. They went to school, got that. Piece of, I'm not saying it's a it's a bad thing, but that's all they know. Work, go to work, get a job, go to co go to school, get a, go to college, get that piece of paper, get a job, work, 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 rack up loans, work, 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 rack up loans. I go home, watch TV, go back to a cubicle. I go home, watch TV, go back. To... They never got the time to learn nothing than that cubicle or that office. So that's all they know. So think about it, guys. When the grid go down and they have no having the power, is that office going to be any, any, any important to them? What are they going to do to survive? How are they going to live? How are they going to support themselves? The only thing they know is to type on a piece of, uh, write on, um, type a piece of uh, keyboard and punch in whatever they need to punch in and take orders, how are they gonna survive? They're not gonna survive. Those are the people that are actually gonna be going first. It's sad to say that, but it's the truth. So anyway, um, I just feel like doing a video. I uh, hope this video makes sense to somebody out there. I'll just 